So we even heard a rumor. Now, this can't be confirmed because the actor strike is going down still today. It's almost at two months now. The writer's strike is at over three months now. Um, and so, no information, official information, can come out until the strikes are over. But we heard a rumor that Marvel, 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 um, is looking at Josh Hartnett for Doctor Doom for their Fantastic Four movie. Wow. Uh, Josh Hartnett becoming the new, uh, I'm, I don't know, the new somebody. The new, the new somebody. He's reinvigorating his career. Kind of like Ben Affleck with the Af Affleck thoughts. We had the Makata thoughts with Matthew McConaughey. We had the Keanu Reeves thoughts with John Wick. Now we might be getting the Josh Hart in our thoughts. Hart, Hart, Nick, Hart of thoughts? Hart on? No, no. I'm not going there. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. That would have been naughty, naughty. Um, but, which is interesting because before this actor strike happened, if you remember back in June, early June, there was a rumor going around that they, that DC, on the other side of the, of the island, if you will, on the, on the other side of the water, if you will, um, that Matt Reeves was looking at Josh Hartnett to play Harvey Dent in the new Batman film, The Batman Part 2, with Robert Pattinson. And in that article, it said they were looking at Josh Hartnett and Joe Edgerton to play Harvey Dent. Now, we don't, once again, we don't know what happened with that, because the actor's strike is still going down. Um, but it is interesting that both DC and now Marvel are both looking at Josh Hartnett. Now, also remember, Josh Hartnett was up for the Batman role for Christopher Nolan's Batman Begins back in 2005. Funny enough, we just saw Josh Hartnett this summer in Oppenheimer, directed by Christopher Nolan. Hey! Um, and Killian Murphy, who was also in the Batman movies. Hey! And Gary Oldman, who was also in the Batman movies. Hey! Um, I'll stop that now. Um, so, Josh Hartnett is becoming a major player. Like that he disappeared for a while other than being on that show, I think it was on Showtime, with Eva Green. Um, but before that, like I said, it was the early two, late 90s, early 2000s. Halloween H2O. The Falcon, the fact, the faculty, the faculty. The fact. Um, and then we had, like, you know, uh, what was that movie he did, like, 40 Days and 40 Nights, the romantic drama, and then Pearl Harbor with Ben Affleck and Kate Beckinsale. Hey, Kate Beckinsale, you can have Ben Affleck, and then when, then when you think he's dead, you can hook up with Josh Hartnett. Oh, wait, and then he dies, but now you're pregnant with his baby. So now Ben Affleck is gonna raise the kid that you cheated on with his best friend. Such a great movie. Great movie. Um, I don't know, I'm going to go somewhere else with that, but trying to keep it rated G. Um, anyway, so like that Josh Hartnett used to be a major player for the teen heartthrob. And like I said, he was up for the Batman role in the early 2000s, when he was still on his hot streak. He's also in Black Heart now with Ridley Scott. So like I said, he was... He was up there. I um, mean, then like that, he disappeared and now he's kind of having a resurgence. With a lot of Guy Ritchie movies recently. And now showing up in Oppenheimer. Now he's looking at Doctor Doom and we don't know about the Batman movie. But let's talk about it real quick. Do I see Josh Hartnett as Victor Von Doom? A.K.A. Not the Doom. Doom. Doom Doom. Um, one thing that Dr. Doom is like Darth Vader. Most of the time he's wearing a mask and a little hood over him. 
Um, I don't think they start the movie with him not as Dr. Noom, as just Victor Von Noom. That will be something. Um, you know, I can't say. I've never really seen him play a villain. So I know he's older now, so he's, you know, he's in his 40s now. He might be a good pick. Um, I think if he's in the mask most of the time, you're just going to hear his voice. So I think it'll really matter. I know a lot of, I, a lot of people actually want Killian Murphy to play Dr. Doom. He has that look, those eyes of his, coming through a mask. They look really interesting. Um, but let me know, do you want to see Josh Hartman as Dr. Doom? Dr. Doom! Dr. Doom! Not Dr. Jones! Dr. Doom! You know, we gotta have, what's his name? Short round. Show up and then down the floor. Not the noom! Not the noom! He can be like a little sidekick. Not the noom! Not the Jones! Not the Jones, no! Not the noom! Don't do that! Don't do that, not the noom! Um, now let me know in the comments below. Do you want to see Josh Hartnett as Victor Von Doom? Not the noom! In the Fantastic Four reboot. From Marvel. Like I said, apparently that, apparently Vanessa Kirby is supposed to be playing Sue Storm. But they haven't been able to confirm that because of the actress strike. So let me know in the comments below, Matt in the back here.